question was was to the points. Um, well, well received from the team. Great re reaction from them. Good training week. So we we um well, I think we we're ready and, and looking forward to tomorrow's game. We have a question, guys. Yaku, sorry, I'll go again. Um, you know, it's obviously the return leg of the Yuxkate derby, um, but I'm sure that you guys really fancy your chances of, you know, just correcting what went wrong last week. And as Cash said now, you know, honesty always can bring out quite, can bring out the best in players. Yes, definitely. We had an honest uh, review on Monday to get all the all the bad stuff out of the way, which is good. Um, so you can start focusing on the weekend and the challenges that's, uh, that lie ahead. Uh, we are fortunate enough to get a second chance at the same opposition. So, um, yes, uh, there's nothing, there's, uh, I can't say nothing, there's not a lot that we have changed. And uh, the, the plan, uh, we only worked hard on the plan we had and to implement it, implement it better. And uh, yes, as Cash said, as far as honest uh, reviews goes, the coaches was honest with us and the players accepted it as it is. Um, and that's professional sport. Um, some you win, some you lose. Um, Cash, it's, it's a completely new uh, back line. I think there's a positional change and then Warner is still there, but the rest is all changes. Is that because of last week's? Um, is that punishment for the guys who's fallen out and to say, you know, not good enough, we'll try a different thing or, or rotational? Why so many changes? I don't know, Zon. <clears throat> I think after on our tour, um, the first four games we, when we went overseas, we, there was a fair bit of change, especially in the back line as well, after two games for the Glasgow game. So um, pretty similar there, guys like Stian. The last opportunity was against Ulster, um, similar to Manny. Uh, Tian was injured, uh, so same with Divan. I think the last game he played was was also there on tour. So um, no, so it's it's definitely not punishment, uh, rotation, and and also probably the way we want to play, um, change it up a little bit, and then have the ability to to, to change it up a little. Bit. Um, and the fact that uh, Wanda Sile is completely out of the 23, is is he okay? Is there an injury? What's the story there? No, just, just rotation. Um, similar to Raps. Burger, unfortunately, um, got concussed last weekend, so he, he still had symptoms Monday, Tuesday, so he, he unfortunately couldn't couldn't make the match day squad. Um, so no, it's just, just rotation. Thanks, Marzan. Uh, hi guys, I don't know if I can go. Um, thanks for the opportunity. Um, Cash, if I could just ask you, uh, earlier in the week, uh, your defence coach spoke about uh, attitude. Um, I take it with some of these changes that you've made, you would want to see an improvement in attitude this week. Hi there, Liam. Um, I think if, if, if you start with, I think there's, there's two points to highlight. Um, Jakub had mentioned a little bit earlier, the, the chance to, to redeem ourselves from the performance, so that that in itself um, should be a change of attitude. And then again, let's, uh, someone like Stian Manny that, that's getting the opportunity, uh, Tian, yeah, but you, you can see the excitement, you can see that they that they haven't played for, for this team in a while. So um, I think change sometimes also bring that excitement and, and they, they're getting opportunities. So we're looking forward to, to see what, uh, what tomorrow brings for them. Thanks. Thanks, Liam. Anyone else? Cash three. Uh, I see Rudolph is um, Australia is on the on at lock and obviously not the tallest lock around. Um, are you expecting a little bit more work in the ground from him playing in at in the second row? Yeah, unfortunately, um, Willem, we lost Willem up to to injury. Um, but he's, he's still a couple of weeks away with with his injury. Uh, we lost Peter last weekend, two weekends ago. So. Uh, yeah, a, a multiple role for him. I think he's, he's showed that he can play play loose forward. Um, we we have used him at, at lock before, so 
uh, like I said last week, is yes, the, the, it brings a challenge probably in the lineup, but but there's also a benefit uh, in the use of all of that. So we're looking we're looking for for a, a big work work rate performance from him. Thanks, Morgan. Anyone else? Yes, Carl. Hi, sorry. Uh, yeah, I'm having a, a bit of a problem here, Coach. Um, you said you you changed the, the 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 game plan a bit around, and uh, that's why the changes. So, would you say that you may be going to continue with this game plan because you've got next week and again a match against uh, the Stormers? Um, I call it. Yeah, obviously, the Stormers present a different challenge to the Wolves. Um, we they managed to suffocate us quite quite a bit last weekend. Um, so. With with changes and change of players, uh, probably a little bit of, of change change in playing style, um, and then next week we'll we'll look again to to what the storm is bringing and how we can how we can uh, put put a game plan together uh, for that specific challenge. But um, yeah, good lessons learned last weekend, and obviously we, we prepped for for one or two changes um, in terms of how we how we want to play. So now we just got to go execute tomorrow. Thanks for that call. Can we take two more guys? What happened? Sorry, can I go again? Yes, uh, cash yes, again. Um, yeah. Sorry, like I said, I'm having some bit of problems aside, but Cash, would you say then this change of um, of of the way that you're going going to play will that this be a more permanent change or? Do you see the change just for the Bulls? Uh, but no, I think it's 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 ninety-five percent of the time it's, it's horses for courses and and uh, picking a team to to play a specific way. Um, like I said, with the rotation is obviously Stian brings Rabs brings you a lot of X factor, um, great pace, great great commitment. Stian is a little bit more physical physical um just just the way he plays so like i said with subtle changes could be could be subtle changes in, in how we're playing um specific for this weekend and next weekend we'll we'll reassess again thanks Carl. can we take one more or everybody happy hi and yeah, so thanks um hi uh, guys um Kesh, specifically from your side um, if you look at the uh, log, um, you are below the the bulls at this stage with the, more or less the same, not more or less exactly the same points um, as as uh, the bulls have on the um, on the on the on the tally. Um, obviously, um, you would like to be higher up on on that um, points table. What what is your immediate goal? Say within the next two or three games before you start traveling overseas, how far do you expect to go up that log? Obviously, as far as possible, but what's a realistic uh, uh, choice there or, or um, goal that you're setting there? Yeah, has, has um, the next three games, uh, one's away at Loftus, one's at home against the Stormers, and then we're playing Leinster away in Ireland. So, uh, out of the next three games, we've got two away games. So, obviously. Um, the intention will, will always be to 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 get a win in, in every game we play. Um, I think realistically, if we can if we can manage between eight and ten points in, in the next three games, um, I think that'll be will be a great effort for myself. Thanks, Simon. All right, guys. Thank you very much. Everybody happy? Thanks a lot. Thank you very Thanks, much. James. Thanks. Thank you. Good luck. Thanks, James. Thanks, Jess. Thanks, Jeff. All the best. Jess, thank you. Bye.